This minute of Skate the Infinity starts with Ricky asking Lunga for a high five. And ends with our favourite palm trees again. This is minute 22 of episode 2, Awesome for the First Time. that for a second. This is Infinite Minute. An anime by minute podcast where we talk about Skate the Infinity minute by minute. My name is Caitlin. I am, my name is Jonathan. And welcome to the show. We are at the end of episode two. Yes, we're up to the palm trees again. Ah, Hello, palm, palm trees. trees. We've missed you. No, we haven't. Um. Um, <laughs> I love the difference between the dub and the sub right at the start here. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love, like, the, the heartfelt Japanese langa. Yes. Versus the just baller American. Hell yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I love. It was great. I love just <laughs> hell yeah. <laughs> Not even heck yeah. He's straight in with the hell double hockey yeah. sticks. Yeah. <laughs> No, it was it was a very like interesting little choice they made. Hell yeah! yeah. The, um, <laughs> Love it. The sub Hell was yeah. so cute though. The, yeah, you're right. Like the longer, like it was so yeah. like longer. I love it. Yeah. Um, and then they fuck for the first time. I mean, no, they do a handshake. Um, no, that's what they do. Um, it is. Uh, metaphor yeah. in my yeah, opinion. Yeah. For sure. Right? <laughs> in my I think in like the show's yes. opinion, it's a metaphor. Yes. Um in my we'll, notes. We'll I just talk wrote, about that when we get to episode ten, but you know. Yeah. <laughs> but in my notes I just wrote, yeah, were they fucking? <laughs> <laughs> Are we watching it? Um <laughs> Sorry this, for it. sorry everyone. No no no. This um this first shot of Lunga just staring so on the ground. On the ground. He looks like, like a seal or something? <laughs> it's the or, big eyes. It's like <laughs> Yeah. Or alternatively, uh Princess Leia in her like slave bikini <laughs> kind of vibes. <laughs> okay, now we need to somehow get Longer's head on Princess Leia. <laughs> but yeah, the big eyes, he's yeah. like mm. He's so innocent and naive, oh. he doesn't understand. Uh-huh. Bless what his did... heart. Longer. <laughs> <laughs> This the whole process though of the dab is yeah. so interesting to watch Lunga's hands because he has mm. no idea like what is happening no. in reality. He's like, what is going on? And I think you can kind of tell that he goes to hold Reki's hand first oh. or something. Like he definitely doesn't go for a high five. Um, because he kind of reaches out to yeah. He, Fantastic yeah. animation. Oh. Like, mm. just the hands. I do, I honestly wonder whether they got, like, they used a ref, like, they filmed someone mm. doing this, these two people doing this whole action to. Could have um, even done it with yourself, kind yeah, of. Yeah, yeah. No, could you? <laughs> no. Well, wait. It would be hard to do it. It would. You would have yeah, to. Yeah, you'd need to get someone else. Yeah. D- don't. Wait. This is why we don't do video on the podcast. Yeah. This is why we don't film our video because we are doing. Yes. Just hands. Also, because I have a doona over my head for the, the whole thing. Yeah. Usually. I've I've just blocked it out now. <laughs> <laughs> you don't see it anymore. No, I don't see doonas. <laughs> um. Yeah, he kind of yeah. does go to grab it. Yeah. Hand animation, just like I love yeah. when um, pi- when they're playing piano in stuff and they hit the right mm-hmm. keys mm-hmm. and like the hands are really well animated. Mm-hmm. Um, and the other show I'm watching, well, one of the shows I'm watching this season, which we'll talk about more in the ED because that's our time to yes, talk about what else talk about other shows. Yes, <laughs> um, there's in the uh, Osama ranking or summer ranking. Mm-hmm. Um, they do sign language to speak to the uh, um, mute main yes. character. Yeah. yeah, and the hand animation on the sign language is, like, wow. crazy. Yes, wow, yeah. wow. So subtle and quick, but it's, like, just yeah. really fluid and good. Yeah. I do so I think probably for all of that sort of stuff they would use... <laughs> Jesus Christ. Animation. You didn't let me finish. <laughs> it's your fault. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> Uh. 
What I was going to say mm-hmm. <laughs> was that I think for a lot of those things, they would use reference videos, hey? Yeah, like they would sure. film they would film themselves doing the movements or film yeah. someone doing the movements and then or find for a reference lack of video. a better word trace the yeah. movement yeah um and it, like, it's just too detailed to be able to just draw that from i mean i'm sure nothing. there are talented enough people that could do it without a reference but i just think the d- level of detail in this dab alone is just crazy yeah yeah, yeah. when do they add the um infinity to episode it. 10 nice you know the kiss is that when they, do you mean the kiss Jono? Uh, is that when they consummate <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> their relationship okay yes the two i'm sorry the two little hands going like this that is a kiss Jono. wow <laughs> but i mean we have our proper indirect kiss now as well in oh, the blu-rays yes which we that's don't get true to with see. the water bottle right. that is true yeah. but yes so they do a high five first that's the well, it's not play. even a high five. It's like a side five. Yeah, it is weird, isn't it? Yeah. Like I'm not. It's not surprised how I would confused. go for a high five. No, you got to do the thing where you look at each other's elbows <laughs> for the perfect <laughs> high five. And that's yeah, how you exactly. nail it every time. Even yeah. the bump. There's like I, I'm paused on a frame where there's like friction in the bump. Um, great band name. Oh. Um, yeah, you can kind of see like. Even just the, like, Lunga's so pale. Yes, Dude. he is. Um, but it's interesting, like, I think, like, Lunga doesn't really get, he's supposed to do the fist until Reki does the fist. Like, he's very mm. much, like, just following Reki's lead here, which is, I just really love it. I mean, this was in a world where we could shake hands. <laughs> and dab, dab. Do you know what's really funny is like, so I started a new job this week and so I was meeting a lot of new people and the um, politics of whether you shake people's hands or not now is really interesting. (laughs) (laughs) Uh, Shall we bump elbows? (laughs) (laughs) It's worse than handshakes. Yeah. At least handshakes, you could like judge a person's character. Yes, I don't get anything out of an elbow bump. Elbow bump, no. Yeah. But at least that now you don't have to suffer through like a soggy handshake i had the soggiest handshake uh with i'm gonna put <laughs> legitimately just gonna put someone like a higher up at my work on blast <laughs> but dude <laughs> if you're listening no 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 one will know he won't listen to this uh, he's like <laughs> in his 50s Uh-oh. your handshake sucked <laughs> you're coming into this business like you're gonna be our boss and you touch me with your soggy limp noodle hand <laughs> give me a proper handshake i'm not a man's man I literally like uh, cried at a boy nailing an ollie uh, in in the last podcast that we did. But if you don't give me a firm handshake, like, come on, come on, mate. Yeah, come sorry on. for my uh, inherent uh, ideals of masculinity. <laughs> hey, no, I think that everyone should give a fa- firm handshake. <laughs> I think everyone should give me a hand. <laughs> I don't care stand. if you're a man or a woman or don't identify as either. You do not give a soggy handshake. It's the no. most disgusting thing a person Hate has it. to sit through. Yeah. <sighs> Awful. Yeah. At least, like, give me a tickle or something. or Like, <laughs> like let me know that you're human and not a cadaver. <laughs> um. Yeah, that's a really bad first impression. So what did, what happened at work? What did you do? Did you bump a lot of we elbows? We just kind of – no, we didn't bump elbows. A few people we actually did fist bump with. Nice. But, that's like, then cool. a lot of people just kind of – we just stood awkwardly and was like, hi, <laughs> hi. <laughs> yeah, it's really we weird. should just bring back kissing, hey? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> why not? Just full kiss on the lips and when you meet. We can't shake hands anymore. <laughs> What if we all in the future have, like, a prosthetic hand that we shake hands with? <laughs> Comes out of our hand. Yeah. <laughs> or we have, yeah, we have to wear, like... Gloves. Yeah. I've already said I like gloves for every occasion on this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> um, for every occasion. Mm, <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> Caitlin Matheson. I do declare you. <laughs> <laughs> no fist no. bumps is cool though but fist i mean bumps, it's the same yeah. problem you're still transmitting True. Uh, transmissible diseases whether yeah. you're like you know holding a hand for a second or fist bumping 
Yeah. Yeah, I know. I don't know. It was a bit awkward. But I mean, it's, but... it's going to be on your elbow anyway. I mean, mm-hmm. the the argument that everyone said about elbow bumping is that you're like meant to sneeze into it. Yeah. So you've still got your germs there. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Um, I guess this just teaches us that we should just avoid physical contact full stop. Yep. Don't yeah. ever touch anyone else ever. No. And don't touch me. <laughs> Please don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> uh and now there's like it's it's even more obvious when people have no like sense of personal space. Yes. When you tell someone they have to be a meter five away and they still get within like fifty centimeters of you, you're just yeah. like <laughs> okay. get away, please. That's yeah. like two or three feet for those of you playing it. America home. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Metric. Wait, don't they say no, it's not a meter and a half. No, I said fifty centimeters. <gasps> oh yeah. Right. But they like- usually say like six foot away, don't they? Yeah, they say six yeah. foot. I'm pretty yeah. sure. Which, Which is- honestly, six feet is probably easier to visualize than a meter and a half. Yeah. I guess and the also standard is, is like one person, right? Like you just imagine a person lying down on the ground between you and the other person. A six foot tall yes. person, yeah. roughly. Yeah. I never realized how below average height I am until I'm at a gig. <laughs> I never realized how above average height I am until I'm at a gig. <laughs> is that like that meme where it's like <laughs> the hands like doing what Ricky and Flunker are doing? <laughs> um, yeah. Uh, yes, yeah, they're holding the, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, um, I hate it. Yeah. There's so many six foot tall fucking teenagers. <laughs> Yeah, but the thing kink is, is, like, I have, <laughs> I have like, shorter friends, and so they're always like, come on, let's go to the front. And I'm like, no, because I'm going to piss people off if I'm in the front. I need mm. to stand, like, in the middle somewhere. At least you're aware of it. You're not like that seven-foot-tall dude oh. in, like, a hat and flanny <laughs> that who gets just stands in front of shoulders. everyone. <laughs> oh, God. Don't even get me started. <laughs> the worst. Yeah. Um, what were we talking about? <laughs> uh, dabbing. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Dabbing. I can't believe you got a new job so quickly. Neither can I. How? I know. You just like, you went through that revolving door. I literally did. Of employment. I mean, I had four weeks off, so that was like that's nice. pretty good. That's good. Yeah. but Actually, yeah. that is huge. Yeah. That's great. It went so quickly though. Like it went nice. really, really quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the new job's pretty chill so far, so we'll see. Nice. See how it goes. Lovely. Yeah. Does anyone know that you they know you're a massive weeb yet? No. And they Good. will not know. <laughs> and they'll never know. They'll never know. They never know. Imagine if know. they'd read your fix. That would be or the wildest this, revelation. Nothing. Could you imagine that revelation? <laughs> like they recognize your voice. Yeah. They hit you up oh on Microsoft gosh. Teams. Yeah. Hey, this is weird, but <laughs> Wild. Do you host a podcast called Infinite Minute, an anime by minute podcast, where you watch Skate the Infinity Minute by Minute? I'm Caitlin. <laughs> I'm Jonathan. Sorry, we got meta there. Um, we're 10 seconds in to this Fuck. minute. And we've talked for 15 minutes, Katie. And I feel what like the there's fuck? still so much to happen in this minute. <sighs> All right, let's get this train moving. Yeah, let's, get, let's get it going. They dab and it hurts like They dab and it hurts like hand. It's very cute. Yeah. Ouchie. And then we cut, hard cut to sketchy. I got a feeling Lunga's a little bit of a wuss. <laughs> Caitlin Matheson putting Lunga Hasegawa on blast. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like he just whines about every single little thing. But Sorry, there's people that's like that, isn't there? Sorry. No, but there's, you know, it's a character Lunga. trait. Um, I can't believe I remembered Lunga's last name. That's just good. Good job. Rolled off the tongue. Really yeah. did. Anyway, sorry, um, let's Sketchy's get sketchy. real cute. He is. Little um, snot bubble. And you can hear his little purr, at least oh. in the dub. He's like. Oh. Actually, now's the time to check, and we're the ones to do it. Does Sketchy in Japanese purr? Find out next time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ah, okay. uh, he does like a little. Oh. Cute. He's so cute. I really want to pet got- him. Little eyebrows. He does. I, I, I don't think I've ever noticed those. Also, like, he has, like, fluff on the inside of his mm. ear. Gotta love that ear fluff. <laughs> so cute. He's very adorable. He looks very cut cozy. You said that funny. Sorry. Oh, cut did cozy. Cut cozy. Yeah. yeah. Um, and Oka. Oka's back. Ah, oh, boy. I love Oka. The, um, <laughs> uh, I also love Oka. 
very much must be said must be said um, but how it would be a, it would be remiss of me to not mention <laughs> how much i love ogre <laughs> but but Reki in the sub in this part was cracking me up <laughs> like just that his delivery of this whole part he's fully just screaming in the middle mm. of dope sketch and <laughs> it was i loved it i loved it so much <laughs> He really is, yeah. He's just fully screaming. Um, he's so he says, "Um, genius." Really, I don't know. Maybe slangy. Yeah. This is one of the only words I recently learnt in the oh. sub. Yeah, because it's ten say. Um, but he says it like te say. Oh. So it's like kind of slurs over the word. He's so excited. He's just yeah. Like rambling. Can't get that n out. Yeah, <laughs> I think it's ten say. <laughs> Heaven, heaven genius? Something like that. Oh. I didn't do my Japanese for today. Oops. Oh, no. <laughs> should do that. Oh, I was going to say I should follow you on Duo, but you're not using Duo. I keep forgetting. No, sorry. Oh, it's okay. Yeah. One you can't eat, baby. <laughs> um, I thought you were going to mention the fact, something we've talked about off mic, because uh, all we do is talk about skate in our day-to-day, apparently, um, how Oka's stage actor. <laughs> oh, uh, looks like Chris Lilly. <laughs> As um, Ricky Wong. <laughs> yeah, star of uh, multiple oh. racist <laughs> <laughs> sketch comedy shows. Um, we're not endorsing thought, Chris no, Lilly. But I, I honestly saw the picture of his his stage actor and the first thought I had was that it looked like Chris Lilly as Ricky Wong. And that I you messaged me and showed me the picture of it and I, I said... Do you know what I? Do you know the first that I had when I saw this? And you messaged back Chris Lilly, and I was yeah. like, "Yes." But legit, like you bring this out of me because I did not think it at all. And then you're like, "Do you know what?" And I'm like, "Okay, what?" Look at it again, and I'm like, "Oh, it's fucking Chris Lilly." <laughs> <laughs> like it just like we've got this. We've got one yeah, brain cell. One brain cell between us. <laughs> yeah. Oh, um, that made me giggle. Don't watch any of Chris Lilly's shows. Do absolutely do not. I reckon I seriously have like some un unpacked trauma from high school because I used to get uh, called Jonah from fuck uh, really whatever it is yeah uh, to- wherever yeah, he's from yeah. yeah um all the time and like I'm neither Tongan no um, n- neither is Chris Lilly um, <laughs> <laughs> I literally just had curly hair and can tan up at a moment's mm. notice <laughs> like yeah, that was that it sucks yeah. So I reckon, and same with Guy Sebastian though. Like every time someone brings up Guy Sebastian, I'm yeah. like, well, here we go. Well, I think I mean we <laughs> so used I get to, to call you Jay Fro back in the day. I know, right? And there's like there's something about having your whole personality wrapped up in just your hair. Yeah. That stays with you. Yeah. Anyway, skate the infinity. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just not unpack my teenage no. trauma <laughs> on our podcast. No, 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 no. Um, yeah. We can. Yeah. We've done it Bottom- before, I think. <laughs> what Bottom would be line, new for us? <laughs> do not watch anything Chris Lilly no. is in. Do not support that man. No. Uh, do not. Racist. Do <laughs> Very. <laughs> done. Done. And probably sexist. Yeah. And homophobic. Yeah. I <laughs> Just would say every, all of those things. <laughs> everything under the sun. And if Chris Lilly hears about this, if somehow he watches Skate the Infinity. <laughs> Those like, down, those Sydney downloads of Chris Lilly. <laughs> <laughs> we, Chris, we are no ones compared to you. But if you hear this, <laughs> fuck, fuck you. you. <laughs> <laughs> God, I feel better. <laughs> I feel better now. We came here to put Chris Lilly on blast today. <laughs> <laughs> we, we actually did. Jono, we're still not even halfway through this minute yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> This is one of those minutes. Um, Lunga looks so unimpressed. I know he always does, but he just could yeah. care less. His hair's really tussled too. Oh, there's a cute little moment when Reki really goes in for the noogie. Um, and Lunga like puts his hand, like grabs Reki to stay up, right? Oh. Oh, he does too. Love that for them. Oh my god, hand on the waist. You know, if that was in a fanfic, it would be like he put his hand on my waist and I felt something. Like that would be like a total. That would be a moment. Yes, 
It would. As I reached in to give Lunga's head a noogie, I felt his warm fingers. Yes. Oh, he'd be cold though. Would Lunga be cold? Because yeah, he's I like snow. Would be cold. Yeah. yeah, I felt the cold touch of his fingers on the side of my school jacket. Jono! And I felt kind of embarrassed because Oka was watching. <laughs> <laughs> and Sketchy was asleep right there. <laughs> Longer, um, not here. Right and I was thinking, Oka looks like Chris Lilly right now. <laughs> <laughs> um, we are going down some rabbit holes oh today. Oh my god! Oka's so done. I need to turn my subtitles on because I was listening to how out of like how just how screaming. Oh yes, um, yeah. It really Japanese recce is. When Oka really says, uh, "Oh." Oh, what? What? You go, you go. No, oh my God, what? There's a whole shot I didn't notice here after Lunga gets noogied and he's just like blowing out one of those, um, like, <laughs> and his hair is so tussled. I did not notice this at all. He's so done. <laughs> he's so done. And then in the next frame, he's still there. <laughs> The tiniest little sliver of his face. Oh my god! In I the love frame. That. I'm taking. Um, this isn't one of my screenshots, but that's just for the personal. Oh my goodness! <laughs> that's just for the personals. That is so funny. <laughs> um, no, what I was going to say is when. So when. Um, uh, 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 when Oka says you only jumped over a twig, he's referring to Recky, like the first time Recky did an ollie. Is that what he's saying? Oh. He wouldn't be putting Lunga on blast, right? He no, doesn't even right? know Lunga. Yeah. I yeah, he'd so. have to be saying that to Reki. Yeah. Which is why Reki would get annoyed, I guess. Yes, true, true, true. You know what I think I've realised I like about Oka? What? He, he's obviously broken his nose. Yes. Yes. If I not that, he's mean. just got that very Roman nose, which yes. I feel is like kind of rare in anime. Yeah, for sure. Everyone's got that very like curled down mm. yeah if if yeah. that sometimes it's literally just like a line you got like a big old bump like me oh yeah yeah do you have a very roman nose ochre cosplay don't mm. oh my god you've don't. got the eyebrows too <gasps> stop it i Can could get you? like a blue i could get like a blue <gasps> one of those blue it'd be so easy too yeah a blue jumpsuit pink t-shirt oh my god i think you have to <laughs> Do I have to do this? I think this is the evolution. Do I have to post, like, (laughs) Femme Ochre Thirst Traps on TikTok now? (laughs) Yes. And Ochre doesn't, like, visibly show any, like, skateboarding skill or anything like that. So you literally just need to, like, stand behind a counter or, like, in front of a green door. Yes, the fingerless gloves. Oh, and you could do something like a little sparkle, like, coming out of the hand. Stop it. (laughs) Like, on a wire or something. Now I really want to do it. You should. <laughs> no, I really want to do it. <laughs> you totally should. This is where we find out. I'd actually would. Now that I'm looking, I'm looking at you and Oka. <laughs> it would actually be really good. Fem. Yes, I'm digging this. Fem Oka. <laughs> All right, guys. I think we've discovered something happen. today. This might be. This happening. might be our longest minute as well. <laughs> this is getting out of control. We're it only is getting it. We're only halfway. Yeah. <sighs> All right. It a shame. It's a really good like realization acting. The um the funny thing with this was that in the Japanese cuz I couldn't understand what was being said. I was just reading the subtitles. I was like, "Oh, he recognized who he was and like he said that he's the Olympic skateboarder when Mia enters." But in the dub, it was so. It sounded so ridiculous when he was like, it "Sounded really it's anime." Hopeful Japanese skateboarding guru Miyajina or whatever. Like I can't remember what he said, but it was so. Yeah. So ridiculous in the dub. Mm. Um, yeah, it sounded very um, <laughs> out of character. Yeah. I would say. Yeah. Oh. Fuck me is fit. If that's his school uniform, like, holy shit, mm. what a dope school uniform. Seriously, I love it. I love it so, so cool. much. I can't, I'm just jealous that he has to wear a turtleneck. Like, mm. It's Chin and Mia, the hopeful to represent Japan at the Olympics. <laughs> it is I, Chin and Mia. <laughs> I don't skate against slimes. <laughs> I love Mia's oh. dub actor yeah 
So yes, many good moments. He is really, really good. Just his little, there you are. Yeah. And I was just like, oh, <laughs> fuck me. <laughs> He's so nasty. He does such a good job. Like, he, he, he does a really good line, like, treads a really good line between, like, bratty kid and, like, mm. Um, like sinister kind, like sinister sort of vibes, like yeah, sassy sinister kind of yeah. He does a really good job, Ryan McKinnon. Yeah, I, I think love his it. name is. Thank you, Ryan. I think it's Ryan. Thank you for your work. It's Ryan or Ryan or something like that. We should know this. We should know. We should look it up. We should know these things. Yes, we should. We should. We should. But he he gets like a little pan up as well. Like when he enters, they like pan up. Rye. Rye. Rye McKeon. McKeon. Thank you, Rye, for your work. Yes, fantastic work. Um, speaking of voice acting, yes. something I noticed weirdly. Yes. It sounds like Dub Recky is in, like, a cave. I noticed that as well. Yeah. That was, okay, so I, th- I wasn't sure if it was just my headphones. But, yes, mm. he sounds like he's screaming into a void. <laughs> yeah, it was really weird, wasn't yeah. it? Something funky went on with the um, sound there, yeah. I wonder if they were recording from home or something maybe. Perhaps, yeah. And then something just went awry. Awry McKeon. <laughs> Thank you for your work. Um, also, something we missed, two weeks is how long it took Lunga to get his yes. Oh, Ollie. right. So two weeks he's been out of. Is our timeline. Right. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Two weeks. Yeah. Okay. Which, crazy to get an ollie in two oh, weeks. Yeah, insane. Yeah. Insane. Um, but yeah, Chin and, Chin and Mia is, he, is here. Is he skateboard, like, through his backpack? Yeah. Like, in between his back yes. and the backpack. Yes, yeah. yes. Okay. Yeah. Which is a cool look. Yes. I was like, is he, like, I couldn't work out if he was, like, holding it or if it was, like, strapped on with the straps, but then I realised that's his backpack. He calls Lunga Big Brother. I noticed that on Ichan. Yeah, but the subs say, hey, you there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Weird. He's so polite. Yeah. But is it kind of like a sarcastic polite? Possibly. No, yeah, I, maybe he's, like, I'm faking. enjoying understanding some Japanese. Yes, it must be so nice. <laughs> yeah, it's like it's barely anything so far, but it's like still. Yeah, just little things you hear and see now. Mm. It's good. Um, skate rat. <laughs> we should have skate a skate rat, rat counter. <laughs> oh my god, too much skate rat. Too much skate rat. <laughs> too much skate rat. Um, yeah, he does. He says on Yichan. Lunga um, is still tussled. <laughs> yeah. In the background. I, like this is this yeah. is mi- this is my first watch and not realizing Lunga likes food. Like I did not notice on two watches how like out of it and yeah, tussled <laughs> Lunga is. I do love the misunderstanding. It's really adorable. It's so cute. <laughs> I mean, we just met, but uh, <laughs> he's so, so like he's so um like bashful and he's a little mm. blush. Oh, and um, Wrenchy gets all blushy as well. Oh. And his little eye closes. Oh, my God. Thank God you're here. Oh, my God. <laughs> I wouldn't have noticed. Um, yes, the little blush. Little Wrenchy blush. That is the sweetest so thing I've cute. ever seen. Oh, little Wrenchy. Oh, my gosh. That's adorable. I love Wrenchy. I want to run a beef against you in S. He's you, so good. you do that um, voice really well, Johnny. <laughs> I just a, a, a good a, a voice I like. I can kind of mimic. Yeah, nice. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> and then this fucking Crash Bandicoot music, bro. The music. I forgot. Oh my god, the so music good. under this is like I was wanted to go dance in a dirty yeah. nightclub. Like, mm, 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 mm. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. It's been a while since I've leveled up. I Just do really like that. I like that they connect like his gaming personality to it a little mm. bit. Like it's like yeah. a video game for him. But in real life that would be so fucking obnoxious. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like <yes. laughs> Oh my god, it would be. I'm gonna pass you in my car and get more Forza points. I'm playing Forza at the moment. <laughs> What's that? I'm really enjoying it. It's a car game. 
What? Card game, Forza. Forza? I've never heard no. of that before. Forza? No. I guess it is an Xbox exclusive. Oh, yes. Then yeah. I would not know what that is. Yeah. I, I, I have never played one before number four, Horizon. So. <sighs> okay. Yeah. Sorry. And maybe I need a more relatable reference. Um, no. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, we're an anime podcast, not a comedy yeah. podcast. <laughs> I don't put comedy in the tags for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Slimes. I wonder if slimes is a, like... Are you just vibing to this music? Is I love the music. <laughs> the music sorry, is so good. I love um, it. I wonder if slimes is like a common Japanese like insult? insult. I took it as like a um, Dragon Quest reference because that's what slimes remind me of. Oh, yeah. But I guess you could just call someone slime. I mean, yeah. even in English, that's a like a bit. Fucked. Yeah. Yeah. True. <laughs> True. You slime. <laughs> slime. Uh, even Japanese ch- uh, Mia is so good. Yeah. His last little, <laughs> it's like, ooh. He looks so innocent too. Oh, he's kind of cute. He is. Yeah. Yeah, I like Mia. He's got cool vibes. Um, Yeah, I love this music. I'm going to listen to it again. Yeah, the music is very fun. I kind of listen to it again as well. Why don't play? You can't uh, see us, but we're dancing to it right now. (laughs) I want to find what this one's called on the um, soundtrack. Oh yes, we'll need to look it up on the. um, Yeah, we'll need to look it up on the uh, soundtrack. I need to find uh, "Touch the Magic Bullet" too. The drop is so good. Yeah. Here's our version of it. <laughs> and there's like, that tingle, there's like the tingly noises. Yeah. Sparkly noises, I would call them. Love it. I'm better at uh, Mia's voice than I am at mimicking music. <laughs> I had the music in the background that whole time, so I have no idea what that sounded like when we were trying to make the noises over the top. Uh, bad. Bad. <laughs> yeah, can you find out what it is? I want to put it on my, like... Running, running playlist. playlist, even though I'm not running anymore. Um, <laughs> on my hype, I'll use it as a hype song. Yeah, hype it up. Um, then we go black. We do. We go back to palm trees. Back to palm trees. We get our little steel drum. <laughs> uh, and that's it. Yeah, and that really quick, like, second frame of night time. Yes, that I had, the did palm not trees. see for, like, a million years until the first time we went to BAD. <laughs> Um, and we're back at our palm trees, and that's trees. my god, that's we another episode it. in the can. We y- always y- do this. Y- I mean, in the one time that we've done it, we celebrate, and then we realize we've got to do like <laughs> another whole two minutes. <laughs> yeah, we do have episode. to get through the ED and the promo for next week. Yeah, but I think yeah. that uh, we're very, very close. Yeah, and we'll do our. Our now standard thing of we'll probably just talk about what we've been watching this season while we do the ED. Yes. Unless yes, we yes, find yes. new things to talk about. Yes, exactly. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see how we go. Yeah. And then uh, promo where we talk about anything but visuals. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we set these weird rules for ourselves. We can do whatever the fuck we want. Um, but yeah. How exciting. Do we know what episode three is okay. called? I don't know it off the top of my head, no. Uh, interesting. No. Should we guess? We can talk, ooh, uh, something to do with slimes maybe? Yeah, I was going to say like slime battle or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Slime beef. Something. That's my, that's <laughs> slime my, beef. <laughs> that's what I'm calling it. <laughs> this is minute three of episode three. Slime, slime beef. beef. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to be that. <laughs> If it's slime beef and we have to say that for 24 episodes of the podcast, I'm going to die. Slime beef. Slime beef. Love that. No, it's not slime beef. No. Oh, what's your favorite moment? Oh, yeah. Um, I, I don't know. Is it them handshaking? 
Mm-hmm. I think that might be mine. The dab is Or it might beautiful. be. Yeah. It is nice, the sun in the background still. Yeah. I think it's this discovery of Mia's dub voice actor. Yeah, nice. I really like him. Yeah. Yeah. He's really good. Yeah. You should watch, if you can find it, you should watch some of, like, uh, Jonah Scott's, um, like, Twitch streams where he has Rye on. And oh. they, like, um, they improv as Joe and Mia oh, together. Oh, that's great. But it's like, oh, yeah. He's so young. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, oh, yeah. I, I hate him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I mean, that, whenever I find out anyone is younger than me, I'm like, I hate you. <laughs> how I know, it's so depressing. dare you? It's like, how dare you be talented and successful at such an early age? Wow, he's done so much, too. Good on him. Mm-hmm. Oh, he voiced bruh in Back Arrow. Bruh. <laughs> I only watched like seven episodes of Back Arrow, but uh, Bruh was in one of them I watched. Uh, they were on like a farm of boys. It was like a boy farm. Like a bike farm of boys. Boy it was farm. like a boy farm. <laughs> you heard me. It was a boy farm, like a farm of boys. A farm of boys. Um, so your favourite moment was the, the dap. Um, I think it was like the dab, but also the music yeah. when Mia showed up. Yeah, that was That was, was great. so cool. Loved it. It got me we'll look so up hype. The name of that music for yes. next minute. Please. Yeah. Please, please, please. Um, oh, he's so young. Oh. <laughs> um, you can contact us <laughs> on Twitter, infinite underscore minute. Or email us at infinite minute podcast at gmail.com. And we'll... See you next time talking about what we're watching this season. Yes, we'll see you then. Bye. 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 I hate him. <laughs> <laughs>